taking a second look at a situation can give us a fresh perspective on things. Hyman Gate, yeah, that's what I'm talking about today. This viral story I'm referring to broke roughly a couple of weeks ago and has been trending ever since. The scenario goes, when asked on the Ladies Like Us podcast about sex education for his children, T.I., a well-known American rapper said, not only have we had the conversation, we have yearly trips to the gynecologist to check her hymen. Yes, I go with her. I will say, as of her 18th birthday, her hymen is still intact. This headline from theguardian.com followed shortly after. Outrage, as US rapper T.I. says, he has daughter's hymen checked annually. When I first came across this story on Facebook, my initial reaction was, what attention-seeking rubbish is this rapper spewing now in his desperation to stay relevant? After all, just a week or so prior, he was involved in an ugly public Twitter spat with female rapper Iggy Azalea, whom he reportedly discovered. The massive backlash that occurred prompted me to examine this further. I'll be the first to admit that T.I. needn't have shared such a deeply personal piece of information so publicly. I read that the daughter in question was so embarrassed by it that she immediately unfollowed her dad on social media to register her displeasure. What isn't clear is if she objects to the yearly hymen examination. The general consensus, however, is that T.I.'s behavior is that of a narcissistic, overbearing, over-controlling man who has no respect for his daughter because he chose to humiliate her and degrade her in this way. I can understand this view, but I've decided to look at it another way. It is no secret that in America, a very high percentage of black fathers are absent, and the few that are present don't seem to care what their children are up to, not to mention a high rate of teenage pregnancies. So the fact that T.I. takes such a keen interest in his daughter's virginity should be something to be applauded and encouraged, especially in that environment. He is a protective father who obviously knows the dangers out there and is just trying to protect and preserve her honor. His way may not be our way, but instead of seeing his actions as oppressive and highly intrusive, I prefer to see it as an act of love. He basically wants to instill some degree of self-worth in his daughter. What is so wrong with that? There's, uh, there's, uh, there's, no, I, I want to know. I mean, you said it yourself. It's, it's, it's intrusive, it's obsessive. Um, I, I mean, yes, you try to at the end sort of, but I, I just think it's... I think it's too much. Um, look, Why is I, it too much? I, Why is it too I, much? It stops at I 18. Mean, He's not look, going to be following um, her. And he look, doesn't even follow look, her. He gets the results. Look, I, I just, I don't know. I, just, it <laughs> I just, know, it doesn't it just, sound right. Well, well, okay, fine. Let me speak for my, It's not something I will do, mm -hmm. okay? Um, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't go to that length to try and ensure that my, my daughter remains the virgin uh, or chest or whatever. I will not go to that length. Um, I think sufficient to say that you have a conversation with her, you let the child know um, what the dangers are out there and the importance of, you know, your, having your own self-worth. I don't think we can equate um, the fact that she has an unbroken hymen mm -hmm. with herself. I mean, it, it's almost trying to say that because someone is a virgin or not, it, it, again, it's, it, let me say it's like slot shaming someone to say, okay, this person has had sex, therefore, this person is not... Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Well, I, I mean, I, I see where I, you're I, going. I, 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 I kind of find what, the whole thing, mm, I think it's, the, a, it's too much. It's just okay. too much. The, it's the, too much for him to do, yeah. I think, and it's also too much for the way he, he, he yeah, put it out there in the public domain. Yeah. I just, I, it's yeah, I think, thing. Yeah, I think he, he crossed the line there. Um, Which part? He, both parts. Okay. That's, um, um, what is that word? Following her, if that's the word I can use, and then also announcing it. Uh, but I don't. But it was in context. Though. It was yes, part but, of a. But but I don't. Th I, I cannot look at him and say that what he has done or is doing is um, is not actually because he loves the girl. Exactly. Okay. Um, yes, he's a, in mm. fact, he has shown me quite clearly mm. that he Love he her. knows what he wants for his daughter, mm. and so I'm impressed. Mm. However, uh, I'm impressed with that yes. that level of. You know, except that he may not. What I feel wrong is that he he's equating things yeah. with other things. In other words, like Emeka said, yes. it's not even because your daughter has had four boyfriends makes mm. her a terrible girl. Exactly, as the one who hasn't had any. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But 
these are the kind of assumptions we mm. make. And so it's easy to fall into that trap of, you know, at least my daughter, nobody, I don't hear of all this. Mm. I, don't, I don't see boys around her. That's good. may not be good, but at least it's a sign, though, that your daughter is, is, is not herself. wayward. Mm. In that, you know, that way we look at wayward. Mm. But, um, um, I mean, it's like the arguments, you know, we're having about this uh, eyelashes little girl. <laughs> um, what they are, you do things and it, and it gives you the impression of other things. And as human beings, we must be always aware that we make an impression and that an impression counts. So if I know I want to be a good boy, I, I, it will be good to, have the impression, to give the impression that I'm good. Mm. Uh, I mustn't. I, mean, I might give the impression of a bad boy, and yet I'm actually good. Mm. Um, you know, well, I think well, somebody, <laughs> somebody knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, okay, I, when I looked at the story, I, mean, you know, I was discussing it a bit, and you know, what struck me is that it reminds me of some of this pastor syndrome, where you know, some people are very protective of their families or because they're aware of the dangers out there. So they say, yeah. oh, no TV in our house. Yeah. And then the children ah. now make TV the desired Price, fruit. Yeah. So you find them anywhere they can see TV. They're even watching pornography and things yeah. that their mates wouldn't watch because right. you know, TV has been made out of bounds. Yes. So you tell someone, you, you know, you, you, I'm checking your hymen, what it might send out to me is that you don't trust me. Mm -hmm. And suddenly, in my mind, I now look like this dark horse. And I, now, temptation of doing everything, but you, you, you may end up just abusing yourself in ways that you shouldn't really have. But I get what you're saying because you know, when, when I listened to him, he seemed sincere in the sense that he said, mm. well, when he grew He's, up, mm. what he knew of his background was he wanted to protect his mom. And he mm. feels that black women are the most abused, yeah. you know, sex Absolutely. he's ever got. So he, it's a sense of protectiveness yeah. that drove him to behave mm. like yeah. that. Ill-informed, yes, but yes. it's protectiveness. And mm. so, you know, a lot of times people do things based on their social background. background you know, but it doesn't mean that the intention is not there. Right. And he just needs to, I think, you know, hopefully be engaged. Because the daughter, he seems to have a good relationship yeah, with I his mean, daughter. The, from what the, uh, he said and also his wife, uh, you know, concurred with was that the daughter didn't actually even really have a problem with the examinations. Mm. But, I would yeah, though. Yeah, I would. Mean, but the daughter didn't didn't mm. seem to have any problem with it mm. because according to him, he, uh, she knew that he was coming from a place of love. Like yeah. she just telling daddy, when, I haven't done anything. Yeah, no, but think, she didn't mind. Maybe for her, it's almost like okay, during, you go to school during the term. You no, wait, let me learn now. During the term, for me, you, 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 you don't trust her. I think I think that came out of a place of distrust mm. or lack Why of trust. Why would you be happy with that? He's trying to ensure that it is enforced. That's all. He's enforcing it in the first place. He tells me you don't trust me. That's my problem with it. Let's get it. I want to take it from, you know, there was another trending story, I think, some weeks back about, you know, parents that children were just vessels that these children, you know, they come from. We don't really have. We can't define their destiny. So we're we guardians. can only wear guidance. We we can only do as much as you know, train. But what they turn out to be eventually is up to them. Mm -hmm. You know. So you you'd probably talk all you want to your child, and you know when you're not there, the child you know does whatever choices, the child wants. Mm -hmm. So I think what I I agree with what you guys have said, but what I what I don't appreciate or, or what he did was, you know, going public with that yeah, information. I, have a major I think it's a private that. information that mm. should not be put out there. If it's something that's between, their, that's what their family has decided. That's yeah. their mm. family yeah. thing, mm. and it should be kept there mm. because she might not really want that. Mm -hmm. You know, I think I guess to I, I hear he does this. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. This reality TV show thing. Yeah, he yes. does. And so a lot of times when people are doing all that, you know, Kardashian, everybody's in your life. Mm. You, you may not know where the line where is the line between is. public ah, and private. Okay. And so he's thinking true. if I. It out could this. be. It could Maybe be from one of those. Maybe they their hands yeah. strengthening to know that okay. you're okay That's, to say I want to protect I my see. daughter's virginity. Okay. It it's could cool, be from there. Yeah. You know, let me I, encourage I, I, you. I, I, it I might mean, as I, well I, be in some village in Kudu, yeah. in Pakistan. Yeah, yeah. second, second. Yeah, yeah, where they kill people for? Female second. Come on, to get tests, to see tests annually. From your daughter means it comes from a place of distrust. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's for me. That's, that's my problem. problem. I don't know why. That's my problem. I don't, I don't accept that. I don't know why. No, we may not. I don't accept sometimes it. we may not. No. We may not I, trust I, our kids. Sometimes we may not trust our child. Not yeah. that we may not from trust. You. That's not no, a very but the, good you have to show me a certificate to say uh, you are your No, no, no. I think it's his apparently she went it's his along but with this, it this willingly. Is, she may have decided she like decided she Africa. doesn't want no, to because do anything. Because everything she has said, I can do that. Yeah, maybe she's right to cheat. Yes, yes. And there's a ceremony they do at one at a particular age, Abby. Yeah, the they do it at a particular test. age. So then, yes, yes there's some cultures they don't, who that does that? South, in South Africa, yeah. Swaziland. 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 Mm. See, that's, for me, it's like female circumcision again. You're, you're treating a woman like there's something to be mm. controlled. Chateau. No. 
it gets into your... her head, let her be convinced, and she will do the control. It's preserve your chastity. Course, I mean, when you when you listen to Tia and everything, do the boys? You, you do the boys? No, no. He says do his sons? Do they? Active. No, no. He okay, so his sons, sons? Do they bring a certificate no, of? No, he says he doesn't virginity. mind about his no sons. Oh, he doesn't mind about. Yeah, because he said that the girl will bring her problem back to the house, and the house is affected. The boy doesn't cause problems. He's a very basic guy. You know, he's very clearly very basic. Clearly, his methods are our methods. I mean, I don't know. Because I've had a very rough time. No, of course. He's a rapper. He came from uh, practically nothing. Yeah. He's seen how they treat this, women yeah. and everything. That, see, it, it, you can't imagine. A, this, yes. this is a reaction. Yeah, Becca has and, and their family is out there. I understand where Becca is coming from. The live TV thing. Is, is, yeah, if, if it was discussed in one of those kind of sessions, you know, then you'd understand. Mm. If they've made their uh, family life public. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's the life he lives. Yeah, yeah no, I, I feel for him though. But he said he didn't really care that the only person he felt upset for, it's you know, daughter. was his daughter yeah. because he, he she told him how and how she felt and he understood that. Yeah. He said he totally understood that. Okay. But for anybody uh, criticizing him on how he chooses to parent that that so what, he was saying basically what, what do you expect what role do you want for, a man from to fathers? Play? What yeah. do you want right. from fathers? Right. When a father decides he's interested enough in his daughter to you care say about this when you say, Oh, he's <laughs> too over much. this. You know, we're we're really confusing <laughs> men in this day and age. I think. We don't care. <laughs> you find your way to, I mean, to no, I'm just saying, protect Those of us without certificates, you, we don't care. You won't be, you won't be the first. The father that you're caring is on another level. You're caring in a different right, way. Right, yeah, 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 yeah you're not the same now. You're not the same. Anyway, we can wrap it up here as it is. All right. Where does the time go? Wow. So much to say and so little time. Your time isn't constrained, though. Do keep your comments coming in on our social media platforms on Facebook, Plus TV Africa, The Advocate NG, or on Twitter or and on Instagram at Plus TV Africa, The Advocate NG hashtag. To catch up with previous broadcasts, go to www.plustvafrica.com forward slash The Advocate NG. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Plus TV Africa. Before you say advocate, we'll be back here again. Same time, same channel, dropping it like it's hot. Till then, it's bye from us. Advocate. <laughs> Welcome to The Advocate a program that thrashes out all the topical issues of the day. When you are in government, you don't see nothing wrong mm, with exactly. whatever is happening. Mm. The Self moment impressed. you are out there, everything is that wrong. Is, you can't even see yes. many women now, and when they're there, they're not even really making a mark, and then they have an NYSC problem, and this is that. Really? It's disastrous for a president to, even say to be unaware. unaware of it, the chief it's justice. It's a ploy. It could be a strategy. That strategy it's was a terrible, a terrible, a terrible <laughs> strategy. <laughs> because the box stops at your table. Whether it's that we don't look after our cities, and quite frankly, Nigeria is becoming a very ugly place. Mm. When you are the only one feeding the people with this news, and there is nobody countering them, it becomes, you know, the, the news.